Darts Nuts and welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm reviewing another set of darts from the shot 80% range and this is another model in the Birds of Prey range of darts and this one is called the Kite and as the name suggests it's 80% tungsten and these are 23 gram you can also get them in 21 grams and 25 grams and they've got a very nice uh, thin ring grip widely spaced at the front and it's also got the cinder grip design around the middle and these retail for £44.95 so let's check them out so as with the other uh, recent shop darts it comes in this very neat small slimline pack and again got nice graphics on the box the beds of prey and all the info on the front and on the back there's a little bit of information about the darts and the range and inside you've got this form insert all in the contents and the darts are fitted with the eagle claw in between stems and it's got these uh, small standard shaped flights with the, the birds feather style graphics on darts are fitted with black coated points and it's a front tapered barrel it's got a slight taper to the nose and the front section is made of these thin and deeply grooved and widely spaced nailed rings um, very grippy that actually I the grippiness is coming more from the gaps in between the rings but the uh, nail on the rings kind of feels edgy as well and around the middle you've got more ring grip and you've got the cinder grip uh, style etching which is in the style of feathers and that's just a flat ring grip but again it's widely spaced and deeply grooved so quite grippy again and obviously it goes thinner around the middle so it's quite comfortable on that part there and around the rear you've got another style of grip which is kind of like a, a thin beveled ring almost like a knife edge not quite as grippy as the two front sections but probably around high medium and on the very end of the barrel you've got this kind of pyramid style grip so there's four different types of grip on the barrel uh, that's probably the least grippy part but as you can see the barrel gets thinner as it goes to the rear but uh, very interesting looking dart and you've got your eagle claw stems and the feather kind of graphic on the st small standard shape flights Starts to fit with a 29mm black coated point. There's a tapered nose to the barrel, that's 4.2mm, and then you've got this chunky front section which is made of these thin nailed rings, quite deeply grooved and widely spaced, that's 15mm wide, and then around the middle the barrel starts to taper, and you've got these flat rings again with wide deep grooves, that's 12mm, and that's got the cinder etching and then you've got this kind of knife edged ring grip which is seven millimeters wide and then you've got a pyramid style grip which is eight millimeters wide and then a small smooth section of 1.8 millimeters on the end length is 48 millimeters and width is 8.2 millimeters twenty three point twelve grams 23.12 again and 23.12 so all perfectly matched and the full setup is 24.66 grams with nothing attached the balance is front weighted and with the supplied setup it moves to the center 
and this is the balance with medium in between short extra short stems and standard flights So that's the shot birds of prey kite, 23 gram darts. Um, probably a very nice dart for front grippers. Um, like I said, it's a little bit chunky, but it's got a very nice grip. So if you want something grippy and chunky and front weighted, definitely give them a try. But uh, I noticed they tend to suit a slightly loopy style of throw, and I think when you do it in loopy, they come down quite nice. So 
if that's the kind of throw you've got then worth a try but like I said for middle and rear grippers if you like that kind of front weighted style it's probably worth giving it a go for me they were flying quite well from the middle uh, not so great from the rear but again if you're a natural rear gripper it'll probably be a lot better but it's still got that front weighted feel because it is uh, quite chunky at the front but it feels a little bit more comfortable gripping around there so like I say if you like that kind of style give them a go but I know these are 80% uh, tungsten and 45 quid which might sound expensive but when you look at the dart itself there's quite a lot of machining gone on to these you got one two three four different types of grip and you've also got the uh, cinder etching so I'd say it's not a bad price at all and it's a very nice dart so that's the end of the review thanks for watching